How's it going everyone? My name is Michael SK. Decided to sit down here for this video to, uh, with my webcam, obviously with, with all this lovely grain, I can't get enough of it. Decided to sit down here with the webcam on to announce that I am going to take a short break from YouTube. This is something I've never done. I've never, uh, I've never actually taken a voluntary break. Usually they're involuntary. Um, whether it's school, which will no longer be a, a factor anymore, but it used to be school, uh, life just getting a little iffy, needing to take the time away, uh, for a few days or, uh, literally getting suspended back in 2016. I lost my channel for a couple weeks. Um, YouTube still kind of did that a couple times with preventing me from uploading a week or so, but every issue seems to get resolved. The point is, is that I've never taken a voluntary break. And I talked about this in my last update video about taking a break. And those that watched it and commented were in full favor of me taking a break, thinking that it was okay. It was okay to take the break. So I will do just that. And my excuse, if you, if you want to call it an excuse uh, for wanting to take a break is I just feel kind of overwhelmed mentally. Physically, I think I'm okay but mentally just kind of not really there, just kind of been struggling in a lot of different ways, trying to figure out what I want to do now that I'm done with school. And really, um, I, I, I don't even know, to be completely honest here and there, but I just have not been 100% or really near it and feel like taking a step back would be good. I know when I was in school and all that, I would do YouTube as a way of de-stressing. I, I really enjoyed utilizing YouTube as a way of de-stressing, stepping away from life and being able to do something totally different than I do on a normal basis or on a daily basis, and that is entertain people, play games, entertain people, and I guess also make a fool out of myself because... As we've seen in my visual novel videos, I'm not the best when it comes to pronunciations or understanding simple things. Luckily, that's something that carries over from just the everyday grind. I utilize YouTube as a way to kind of step away from the, from the regular grind and entertain people. And it's been something that I've been able to do for about a decade. This is my third channel that I've created where the other two were kind of just you know, experimenting with the platform and seeing what I can do when I was in high school. I think I started when I was a freshman. So this coming out, this channel was, uh, I think, whenever whenever I was a, a junior in high school. Now I'm 24, graduated with my bachelor's, and now I need to figure out what I want to do in my life, and I need to figure out what will make me happy, what will... Uh, Get me, at, get me back up to that 100%, I guess you can say. The webcam is on here so I can be as sincere as possible to say thank you to all of you who have shown me support, gratitude, anything in these past few years, whether you're a new fan of the content that I'm uploading now, of content that I upload in general, or you've been around from the beginning. I, I'm still very grateful. And I want to also kind of, I guess, apologize for wanting to take this break, but at the same time, I'm hoping that it can be understandable as I would like the time to, as I was saying earlier, figure things out and get back up to that 100%, but also see if I can find a way to allow YouTube to be a distressor yet again, as it has kind of not really become that. As of late, it, in a way, YouTube has become a stress factor. I am absolutely overjoyed to be able to make videos, but I'm not overjoyed when there are consequences to some videos that I've made. The Grisaya series, for example. That wasn't the most uh, all ages game to, to those that know the visual novel. And I didn't do the best with leaving out content as much as I should. I tried to include as much as I could while also being in the lines of YouTube and their guidelines, as well as being entertaining. Uh, 
basically going with the actual title that I threw in the in the in the names of those uh, of those playthroughs that I've done with Grisaya. And that usually does come around to bite me in the ass. And Grisaya is just an example, but there are some other things. I don't want to remove those. They're, I would say, align with YouTube's guidelines, but others would say otherwise. And I guess you could just say that there's a bit of a fear with um, with what I have on YouTube. Even if it's nothing serious or dangerous or against the rules or anything, I have a stressful fear that the end of my channel could come at any time. And all the work, the effort, everything that I've put into it could just disappear. And this was not a fear that I had whenever I started recording. And this was actually a full-on distressor. It's kind of just changed, I guess you could say. Regardless, I'll just uh, leave it at that. And um, at the end of this month, I will stop recording videos and stop uploading. Uh, for the majority of October, I'm thinking. I'm not really sure. It'll just be a one month or so off from the YouTube grind. And then I'll come back and hopefully everything will be just a little bit better. But in the meantime, I'm going to uh, finish up Higurashi Chapter 4. That's going on right now. I want to finish that up. I want to do one more episode of Steins Gate Linear Bounded Phenogram. And I think that'll wrap up the section that I'm currently in with Aura. So when I do come back, I can just finish that game up on my own and we'll be done with it. And when I come back, we will continue on with the Grisaya spinoff game that I'm playing. And maybe I'll uh, pick up another game. Now, right now I'm just playing visual novels, but maybe I'll pick up another game to uh, start a playthrough for. And maybe that's what I'm missing is just a, a regular old game. Maybe. I don't know. While I'm gone, uh, there are some playthroughs that I do want to point out in case you'd like to see more content that I've made over the years that I say are my top three in both visual novels and games. I'd like to advertise them to you because that's all I'll be able to do during my break, is just allow you guys to watch the content that I've already made. So my top three for visual novels would have to be Wonderful Every Day, Any of the Grisaias, and Chaos Child. And, and there's no order here, but those are my top three. If you guys want to watch another visual novel playthrough here by me, those are my three. And now for games... For games, I'd have to say Persona 5 Royal and a most recent, and it's not very long, is Star Wars Battlefront 2, the campaign with my good buddy Alex. That was a lot of fun to record that. And Near Automata, which I did with my buddy Jared. Those are some fun games that I recorded very recently, I would say. Maybe Near is the one that was pretty far off. Maybe not too far, but if you guys want to watch some games, those are those. Visual novels as well. Feel free to enjoy anything that I've recorded. I record a lot because I want to allow people to watch these videos whenever they want. And while I'm out for a month, hopefully that allows you to... I, I guess if you get entertained by the content I make, hopefully those will, uh, those will be enough. Thank you again for all the support, for everything so far, and I'll be back when I'm back. Thank you again for your understanding. And uh, again, I hope that YouTube becomes in the position that it was in whenever I started it, where it's not as stressful and it instead helps with the stress. And I hope that I can uh, straighten things out with myself. Thank you again. And have a good one, guys.